So here I have a page that shows my free live trainings for bloggers and online entrepreneurs. And I've created this page layout, which I really like because it shows my three workshops in a beautiful streamlined fashion. I have these anchor links connected to the buttons. When you click on that, it takes you to the corresponding training. And I really like that look and I've done this using anchor links. So let me jump into my dashboard and show you how to do this. So here I am in the back end of my Squarespace site and you can see that I've created an index over here for my live training. And this index contains one, two, three, four, four pages. The live training intro, which is this banner image with these three buttons. Then I've got live training one over here with the first training, then live training two, the second training, and live training three, the third training. So what you need is to know the URL of all these three pages. So for example, live training one, the URL slug is live-training-1. Copy that. And then I follow the same logic for live training two and live training three. So if you follow the same logic in how you name your pages, it becomes quite easy. Okay, so I go into my live training intro section over here and where this button is located, click on edit and under click through, I'll paste that URL slug that I just copied and right before it, I will add the hashtag or the pound sign. Click apply, go to the next button, hashtag, paste live training two, and the third button similarly, pound sign, live training three. Click on apply, click save. Now click on that arrow to see the page full screen. When I click on watch now, it should go to this section here. Yes, it does. Watch now here goes to this section and watch now here goes to the third section. If you want, you can change the background of this page so that you create a bit more distinction. I have another video in which I show you how to change the background color. So you can check that out over there. So now all three buttons here have the anchor links that go to the appropriate section on the page. This is a really good way of presenting a collection of items that you may have. Uh, you can use this uh, page layout for displaying your services. And then instead of watch replay, you can have the buttons here linked to the specific page that talks more in detail about service number one, service number two, and service number three. So you can lay out your services like this. You can lay out three most important videos, uh, make a training page, something like this three important blog posts. You can use this page layout in many different ways. All right, so that's how you create those anchor links. Go ahead and build it in your own website and come back in the comments, drop me a link and show me what you have created. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.